Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome back. My name is Nadia and Sands. This, of course, is Learn How to Edit Stuff. And today, we're gonna do stuff for TikTok, I guess. Now, I do not consider myself a TikToker, but I do know of TikTok, and I do know that there are people out there that wanna learn how to recreate TikTok videos, and I got some messages from you guys about this video right here from Freeman Butt. She's dancing, her body parts are collecting on her body like some sort of weird DDR effect, and so today, we are going to recreate that effect for you guys that wanna learn how to recreate TikToks. We're just doing a lot of recreation. Here's what we're gonna be doing today. It is immaculate, it is amazing if I do say so myself, and it is going to take no time at all. Have you noticed the runtime on this video? It's a short one. I'm trying out a new format for these videos so we don't waste a tremendous amount of time. Open up Adobe After Effects, but before you do that, choreograph yourself a stupid dance because we're getting started right now. All right, guys, first you're gonna to wanna to choreograph a really stupid dance. Then once you've done that, get your footage into Adobe After Effects. On the timeline, find the point that you want your body parts to collide in the video, Duplicate your video by hitting Control D, then right click on the top duplicate and choose Time Freeze Frame. Now, using the pen tool, cut out the part of the body that you want. The more time that you spend on this, the better it will look. Once you've cut out the body part, center your anchor point on the layer by hitting Control, Alt, and Home on your keyboard or going to Layer, Transform, Center Anchor Point. This will make sure that when you rotate or scale, it will scale from the center of your shape. This is very important. Now, without moving your timeline indicator at all, set a position, scale, and rotation keyframe for your freeze frame layer. Now go back anytime before the freeze frame happens and animate your body part flying in. You can do this however you want, just have some fun with it. Now trim your freeze frame layer where your last keyframes are by selecting the layer and hitting Alt and the right bracket on your keyboard or dragging your layer from the right all the way over to where your keyframes are. This will make sure that the freeze frame disappears once your body gets into position. Now repeat this same process for however many dance moves you want to do. The longer your dance is, the longer this will take, so be patient if you want this to turn out good. And once you're done, you'll have a body part DDR style TikTok video thing. You can also spice things up a little bit by adding some color effects, motion blur, and camera shake to make your effects look much cooler and like you spent a lot more time on them. Well, there it is, and there you have it, folks. Short and simple, just like you like it. If you're not following me on TikTok, maybe you should, at Naughty and Sands. Can't promise I'll post anything, but hey, I do have an account. Also, if you guys have not joined my Discord yet, links and everything you need to know are in the video description below. There's a bunch of stuff down there. Free trials to Epidemic Sound, a bunch of stuff for Invato, the Discord links, all the links you need are in the video description below, but you know what button to press next. You're gonna hit that MF and subscribe button, and you're also gonna check out the last video that you missed. We do them here whenever I want during quarantine on Learn How to Edit stuff. I have no schedule. I don't really know what's going on. Subscribe, check out the last video, and I will see you next time.